फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट मी टेल यू व्हाट वेंट रॉन्ग विद नोकिया Just today morning I uploaded a new video on Nokia's comeback in 2K17 and after a few hours Nokia went rogue and launched their first phone of the year. Let's take a look. Baby, I want you to know. Hey guys, it's Tiki Vita here and today everyone was shocked when Nokia hit the market with their first phone of the year in China exclusively. But I'll come on to that part later in the video. Let us first see what Nokia has brought today for us. Nokia named their phone Nokia 6. God knows what that 6 means, but that's the model number we have. The look of the phone looks premium, and I kind of like that black color. It sports a 5.5 inch Full HD display with 16 megapixel camera and one micron pixel sensor. It comes with a good f 2.0 aperture. with dual tone flash that means that it will get some good pictures and that bokeh effect for all the selfie lovers you will get an 8 megapixel camera with f2.2 aperture and a 84 degree wide angle view with 1.12 micron pixels sensor that you can expect some good photos in low light also as far as performance is concerned it packs in qualcomm snapdragon 430 processor with 4 gb of ram for multitasking something which i personally like is that it comes with 64 gb of internal memory and a micro sd card support so all the companies that manufacture 16 gb of base model phones your daddy is back powering all this we have 3000 milliampere battery and for those guys who think it's less for them here is a quick tip when the phone has full hd display and nothing fancy and comes with a medium range cpu this battery should last you for the day dolby atmos dual speakers are rare but it will definitely make your movie experience pretty good as far as security is concerned nokia is bang on with the fingerprint scanner but on the front side and it also doubles as a capacitive home button thank god this package is not ending bad because it packs the latest android 7.0 nougat and i guess it comes with a near stock android experience earlier i told you that it is only shipping in china through jd.com but nokia wants to test the market before it is launched globally and as all the manufacturing units are in china it reduces a lot of expenditure on transportation so they selected china as their first market seeing all this i am pretty sure that nokia will be releasing two new smartphones in the mwc 2017 in february I guess it is in Barcelona. If you have any questions regarding Nokia's comeback or strategy, don't forget to list down in the comments below. After the global launch, if you want to see the hands-on review, subscribe to the channel and stay tuned. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Something which I personally like is that it comes with an internal memory card. Something which I personally like is that it Something which I personally Okay. <laughs> Something which I personally like is that it has a 64 GB memory card. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, you're the fight.